What's going on everyone? Today I'm going to be showing you guys my entire baseball card collection and also some other cards. So, we'll start off with this one. This one is just a bunch of current stars, past stars. Uh, so as you can see there's a lot of inserts as well. Color cards. And then <clears throat> right here we have a Yankee binder for my Yankee PC. So I just filled it with uh, a bunch of Yankee cards. Any Yankee play, doesn't matter. Uh, so yeah, that one's filled. This one right here are players from the 70s to the 90s. So yeah, I got Joe Negro, Phil Negro, Tommy John. Just a bunch of cards from the 70s throughout the 90s. A lot of um, pages of the same player. I got, I think, three or four of these binders. So, to the left of that is a current stars. So, either retired or that play 2000 until 2020. So, I guess current for the past 20 years. So, there's a bunch of good players, inserts... Just a bunch of random cards thrown in here, not in really any order, besides the fact that they have played during the past 20 years. That's how I like to organize my cards. So, mainly by year and player, the type of players and like, not type of players, but like when they played. So, yeah, got that one. To the left of that is an older, older players. So you got. Robin Yell. This binder's more organized, so. There's pages of the same player, more Robin Yell. Paul. Uh, we got Steve Carlton, Sandberg. Then below that is a collection set from McDonald's from the 80s or 90s. Nothing special. And then moving up to the top row. We have current players for the past 20 years, so just a bunch of, this one's sort of organized. You got a bunch of um, Steven Strasburgs right here. Miguel Ichiro, Tim Lincecum, Kershaw, Griffey, Prince Fielder rookie. Just a bunch of cards that I uh, think deserve to be in this binder. To the left of that, we have another older player binder. So, like, Griffey from the 90s and 80s. Bunch of Griffeys. You got Barry Larkin. I believe most of these are Hall of Famers. So, you got Kirby Puckett. Andre Dawson, another Hall of Famer. Tom Glavin. Barry Larkin. And all these binders, by the way, they're pretty bulky. They're pretty filled, besides this one. This is a brand new one. But yeah, most of them are filled. So, the last binder is the biggest binder of them all. And it is players from 80s and 90s, once again. So, not even just Hall of Famers, just any players. So, Howard Johnson, you got Bert Bevelin, whatever his name is. You got Eric Davis. That one's pretty bulky. So, these are all the binders in my collection. And then, on to the boxes. The boxes are a little bit different. They're organized by year. So, most of them are organized by year. And the cards that I, ha I don't have much of, I just throw the whole entire brand into one box. So, you got Bauman here. You got Stadium Club, Pinnacle, Pacific, and Leaf in this one. Bunch of tops from the 80s and 90s. Bunch of junk wax. Then you got Donruss, Donruss just cards from 2000 and up, 89 tops. These are other sports right here, so it's like I have basketball, football, hockey, a Pokemon from when I used to collect Pokemon. Some more tops from 2012, 2014, 16, 20, Fleer, Heritage, uh, what is this, Gypsy Queen, Allen and Ginter, Audi, not Audi, <laughs> O back for the O. And then 
bunch more tops. We got score. We got upper deck. Two boxes of upper deck. And then some other sports. And then these are the complete sets. Uh, so this is just a random score box that I have when I open it. Right here we have a uh, 1989 Bauman set that I got for seven bucks. Box is completely destroyed, but it is a complete set. So we also have 19, two 1993 complete sets. Got the Jeter rookie in there. And then we have a 2012 complete set, 2011, and then a 2010 complete set as well. So those are cool. There are all the boxes. And then lastly, I'm going to show you guys my uh, best collection, like the single cards that I have in a box right here. This is my PC, Jim Abbott. So all these and all these are all Jim Abbott cards and cases. And then we just have a bunch of um, protective sleeves, penny sleeves. And then in here, it's also part of the PC. So it is, this isn't, but it's just a, I didn't have anything to put in here, so put this in there. I love the Yankees. Got a Yankee ticket. And then in here, we have um, three autographs from uh, Jim Abbott. Three or four, I think. Yeah, we got four. Four autographs from uh, Jim Abbott from my PC. I just like keeping it in this tin. I, put, I don't put anything else in here, so might as well put some cool things in there. And then... Yeah, so like I said, if you want to see some of these, you got Ozzy Smith from 81, Tom Seaver, Gaylord Perry, just a bunch of rookies, Jeter rookie, Rizzo rookie, that is not a Rizzo rookie, Kyle Schwarber rookie. Let's see what else do we have. These are just autos, I also have a couple autos. Eddie Murray, Joey Gallo rookie, and yeah, that is my whole collection. If you guys want to see this box in depth, in depth, um, just let me know because these are I, I love this whole lot right here. Relic card, I mean, the relic cards are cool, but they don't really. I like a uh, vintage more. So yeah, whole collection right here. If you guys enjoyed. Leave a like and let me know what you think. Peace.